Hi, welcome to ClickMyProject. The title of our project is Self Configuring Intrusion Detection System. Let's see the overview of our project. With the rapid extension of our computer network during the past few years, security has become a critical issue for modern computer system. To identify the malicious activities, various data mining and, and machine learning techniques have been deployed for intrusion detection. The manual tuning process required by current system depends on the system operator in working on tuning solution and its integrity. It into detection model. This paper proposed a self-configuring intrusion detection system to make turning or tunings automatically. The key idea is to find the binary slipper as basic module which the rule learner has based on confident rated boosting. The system is evaluated using the NSL and KDD intrusion detection data set. An experiment result shows the SCID system that is self-configuring intrusion detection system with slipper algorithm given a better performance in term of detection rate, false alarm rate, total misclassification cost and cost per example known as NSL KDD data set and other KDD data set. In our existing approach, we divide our intrusion detection into two classes. One is anomalous detection and misuse detection. In anomalous detection, the problem by attempting to find the de deviation from the establishment pattern of using misuse detection is compared. The usage of pattern to no required pattern of hurting become harder. FB, FB rate is also become low. The poor performance is maintained in our existing system. In our proposed model, in our proposed model which implements an network based anomaly detection system using uns unsupervised learning algorithm. They show that how the pattern recognition feature of self-organizing map algorithm can be used for intrusion detection. Thus the final aim was to detect the intrusion separate packet with anomalies of from normal packets. The false predictive rate is also become lower in our proposed method. The first um, important deficiency of KDD data set is the la is a huge number of detection record. Analyzing KDD data set and the test set is may found that 78 percentage and 75 percentage of the record and duplicates of the train and the test set respectively. In our second limitation, the data set lines with the distribution of five classes, normal construction and the four intrusion types, DDoS, probe, U2R, uh, U2R and R2L are the types of attack. The first two classes compromise a holding of 98 percentage of the entire original data set and 97 percentage are can be improved data set after removing the duplicate instance let's see the let's see the flowchart of our project this is our flowchart first we are extra we have a data set then we have the data has pre-processing in our pre-processing stage we are going to extract our data and we are introducing our int introducing our data into an prediction engine which eliminates all the duplicates data that is using the fal mm, false prediction rate and the system operator which operates and finds the false prediction when the false prediction was found it will be found for the automatic tuning if not the prediction will get continued let's see the demo of our project this first is our data pre-processing stage that is here we have uh, two kinds of data set one is nsl data set and another one is kdd data set when i click on this kdd data set a new window has been uh, shown that is when we click on this browse button here we have a data set that is a uh, two kinds of data set one is an N nsl data set and another one is kdd data set now i am going to retrieve a data uh, extract the value of kdd data set i am choosing my own location where I have stored my data set. Here I stored my data set in this folder, uh, the data set particular folder. First I am choosing the intrusion 1 and I am going to extract in data set. Here I have more than 5000 of data sets so it takes a few minutes to extract all those data. Now uh, the data set has been extracted successfully. When I click on this view button uh, my data set has been extracted and will be viewed by all the that is here I have range value, protocol, class, attacks, input, output, real value, recognized value, unrecognized value and the basic levels when the system tu before tuning was has been found. Now I am going for another data set that is NSL data set. Here I am choosing my data set in my own location. I have I have chosen my data set. Now I have extracted since our data set contain the large values. It will take few minutes to extract our data set.
here the data set has been extracted successfully when i click on this view button my data set has been viewed here now i have both nsl and kdd data set let me determine with these two data sets will be determined our intrusion detection system second module will be the rules now i am loading my data here uh, here where the load data has been loaded where all the uh, false prediction and the, the data has will be get eliminated when i click on this rule set nsl data set uh, the eliminated value will get recognized and the rest of the values will be viewed here when i click on this nsl kdd data set that is i am pounding the recognized value for rule set uh, for n uh, for nsl kdd data set here here also the uh, duplicate values were get read uh, um, and that is i am and pounding the values with the uh, binary values that is with the help of the slipper algorithm this is about our implementation of rule set let's see about let's see the next uh, next stage that is a false prediction this is my next module this is a false prediction window when i click on this load button on our um, slipper algorithm here all the values would get loaded when i click on this predict the value here the attack type input value and the output value and the um, uh, no, actual false predicted rate has been defined that is here the user have given the input value is uh, one and the output value is one now the exact input has the output has been found that so the false predicted range was found here as zero that is no false was predicted that is here, here no attack was found input value will be six 1064 something but the output will be one so here more number of false has false has been detected detected so the i have analyzed with my system design and the false prediction rate has been founded here when i clicked on this uh, when i predict the value for nsl kdd data set the same method has been followed the but the false detection rate has been lower when an nsl kdd data set so comparing with our nsl data set our, in our nsl kdd data set the false prediction rate has been lower next will be code for tuned set this is our tuned set confident window in so next module when i click on this tuned confident here uh, we have found some attacks that is false prediction attacks over there those attacks will be tuned here that is let be analyzed either whether we have any other false prediction rate. it will be very minute that is why either by point value or by point 5 or some values we have found it here when i click on this tuned nsl kdd data set the same procedures will be followed here but here we have the tuned will get be lower and the rate will be found it here that is the detection rate the detection rate is some thing and the false alarm rate will be that is the more we have more number of detection right and the false alarm rate will be lower when i go with this uh, with this nsl kdd data set the detection rate will be the higher and the, it will be in the minus value and false alarm rate is also in the minus value since we have found out the detection rate was highest at the range as possible and the at the final stage we are going for analysis i just click on this analysis button this is our analysis window when i click on this nsl nsl kdd data set this is a comparison of nsl and kdd data set that is the false alarm rate is higher and the detection rate will be lower in our kdd data set the same thing our detection rate is higher and the false alarm rate will be the lower that is using our kdd data set we are pounding our detection value with as low as possible that is no attack has been found at the, the use of this slipper and the ripper algorithm thank you